Your car can capture vast amounts of data. But what actually happens with the information that it stores? For our investigation into hackable cars, we examined a second-hand car infotainment unit from eBay. Our experts found a whole host of leftover personal information on it, including the previous owner's contact details, home location, and Wi-Fi password. Whether you're selling your car second-hand or handing back the keys to a car you've hired, leaving your data on the vehicle could put your privacy and even safety at risk. Follow our tips to wipe data from a car, just like you would when selling an old smartphone. Before you sell your car second-hand, access the infotainment unit. Look for controls to remove your accounts and data. It's a bit like restoring a phone to factory settings. If you can't find it easily, check the manual. Deleting the car's app doesn't actually revoke your access. You need to break the link between you and the vehicle. Again, this should be done via the infotainment unit on your car and delete the app once you've finished. Just as you think of mileage, service history and state of repair when buying a used car, you should also think about data. Always ask for evidence that the previous owner's data and their access rights have been removed before you buy it. Otherwise, that person could track, unlock or even drive away with your new car. Chances are you've plugged your phone into a rental car and seen data on other people who've used it. So, when renting a car or using a vehicle from a car club, it's best to just use the infotainment unit on its own or just rely on your smartphone. 